Now in Hungarian notation, it's really used for naming variables in particular. And it's where we have a three-letter prefix attached to variables in much the same way as I did up here when it came to naming my controls. It's just that the prefixes are going to be different, slightly different anyway, when I'm naming controls versus naming variables over here in Hungarian notation. So if I wanted to change these two variables here, first name or name to Hungarian notation form, as they're both string, I would start with a three letter prefix str for string. And then write the name of the variable. If it was an integer value, for example, I might go int age. Or if it was a decimal value, dec profit. These are all variable names. They're doing exactly the same thing as my variables uh, that use camel case spelling at the top here. It's just over here in Hungarian notation, there's a three letter prefix. You can always tell that these are variables and not controls because the prefixes are different to what you'd use in controls. So str for string versus txt for text for a text box control and so on.